will carry those experiences in my heart for life. Make it no secret that whatever your goals are, you will reach unfathomable ones here at Tarleton State University. I am so honored to share this special place that I call home with all of you. Hey, Oscar P. Back to you, Alex. Wow, the energy, spirit, and rich traditions are one of a kind. I can clearly see why Tarleton bleeds purple. I'm definitely gonna need to come back for homecoming. Thanks, Magnolia. Let's say hi to Lily. Lily is a sophomore in education major who lived in Honeywell Hall as a first year student. Here's Lily, who's gonna walk us through life on campus and all the options students have just steps from their home away from home. Hey everybody, and thank you for the introduction, Alex. One of the biggest aspects of college is living on campus. What your dorm will look like, who your roommate will be, all of the activities that take place in between. Tarleton State University provides a welcoming living and learning environment and gives you a home feeling that not a lot of universities have. Living on campus, everyone on my floor became my family. We went to every event together, cheered at every home game, and started our own traditions within our friend group. We even had cookouts in the kitchen of our building with our resident leaders. Everything on campus is within walking distance and very easily accessible. The dining hall and the student center are right in the center of campus and both provide a wide variety of eating options, including national chain restaurants. And both make for great study and hangout spots. You're also in close proximity to mental health and physical wellness resources with our campus recreation, aquatic center, and our student health and counseling center. You'll probably see me and my friends at the rec playing volleyball together. I can say without a doubt that living here at Tarleton has been one of the best experiences of my life. I've made lifelong friends and countless memories. Tarleton has given me a second family. I know I can count on my friends and residential leaders to be there for anything I may need, even if it's just somebody to walk to class with. That's all from me. Alex, wanna join us on campus? Absolutely. It's clear to see why anyone would want to live here. And you've made so many great friends along the way. Maybe I'll run into you at the REC. Thanks again, Lily. Let's chat with Madison. Madison is a senior kinesiology major. She'll tell us about her experience working directly with patients and how her time at Tarleton has prepared her for the next step after college. Madison, it's all yours. Thanks for the introduction, Alex, and hello, everyone. Being a fourth generation Tarleton Texan, I knew I wanted to get as much out of my time at Tarleton as possible. Tarleton has helped prepare me for my future career as a healthcare professional through hands-on learning experiences. Tarleton really stands out with its emphasis on hands-on learning. Across all majors, students get real-world experiences as a part of their degree program. As a kinesiology major, our hands-on models and anatomage tables enable us to study in depth. Our classes incorporate a lecture and lab model where we learn the material and the procedure and then have the chance to safely put it into practice using equipment in class. The Kinesiology Lab is another great resource as it provides the opportunity to gain experience with real people who come into the clinic. An observational internship is also incorporated into our degree plan to give us clinical experience in our career setting, which is a huge asset when it comes to applying for secondary programs and jobs. More examples include our year-long teacher residency programs, the Tarleton Agricultural Center's Working Farm, the Phage Lab where students get to research viruses, and our broadcast journalism studio where students get true to career experience in news production. These experiences prepare Tarleton students for success beyond graduation and into their career. Our professors also do their very best to ensure that we succeed. Through all of these experiences, I've learned what professionalism looks like and what it takes to become a good student and clinician. After graduation, I plan to attend chiropractic school and specialize in working with children or athletes. I can't wait to give back to my future community all of the skills, compassion, and resources that I've been given at my time at Tarleton. Well, that's my story. Back to you, Alex. Madison, thanks for telling us all about the different opportunities to get hands-on experience, both in kinesiology and across campus. 
it's clear Tarleton students are ready to succeed in any career field. We're gonna hear from James, a biomedical science student from Flower Mound, Texas. From the moment James became a Tarleton student, he was connected with mentors who have helped guide his journey to ensure success. James, it's all you. Thanks, Alex. What's up, everyone? Growing up, I always knew that I wanted to pursue a career in the medical field, and that all starts with the proper education. While searching for the best college, I came across Tarleton and immediately knew that this was the right place for me. I was greeted with all kinds of student support. At Duck Camp, I had two Tarleton transition mentors who helped me build confidence and taught me all the traditions. When I started my first semester, I was assigned two more peer mentors who had the same major I had. My incredible mentors offered in-depth solutions to all my questions, and I really owe it to them for my accomplishments. Here at Tarleton, we have knowledgeable and understanding professors who strive for students not only to finish with a high grade, but also to completely understand the subject. Working with Tarleton professors has been a pleasure, and I know that they're positioning me for success. In addition, we have many great resources to ensure each student's success. Academically, we offer the Tutoring and Learning Center, Math and Science Clinics, Supplemental Instruction, and much more. When it comes to paying for school, 85% of Tarleton students receive some sort of financial aid, and we have over 500 scholarship opportunities. Over half of our student body is first generation, and our Office of Diversity, Inclusion, and International Programs offers resources that encourages an equitable, accessible, diverse, and inclusive campus culture. Tarleton is committed to making sure all students receive everything they need for the best college experience. I serve as a Tarleton transition mentor and peer mentor to give back the support that has helped me become successful. Tarleton's student-focused approach had made my experiences amazing, and I know that I'm prepared for my future and can handle any obstacle that comes my way. Thank you so much for listening to my story. Over to you, Alex. Thank you for sharing your story, James. Your evidence that every Tarleton Texan can reach their full potential. But the real question is, how do I get some of those duck camp overalls? That was awesome. Take care. Let's go see what Arad is up to. Arad is a mathematics major studying data science specializing in infectious diseases. He's gonna tell us about how one-on-one -on -one attention from his professors helped him find his calling and his place at Tarleton. Arad, you are on. Thank you for that introduction, Alex. Hey, what's up, y'all? Growing up, I was always told to focus on my math and science, but I didn't think that my career goals would lead me to such a place where I would meet lifelong friends and amazing faculty mentors. I had several options for college, but Tarleton really stood out over the others. Great faculty-student ratio, great personal attention. Here at Tarleton, students know they are a name, not a number. My first year, I learned I wanted to study infectious diseases, and my professors and mentors guided me to the right major and path. During my first semester, I was introduced to the vast world of research by a mathematics research professor whom I currently conduct undergraduate research with. Since then, my life has never been the same. I have conducted research with several faculty members, had the opportunity to work with the university president, and even created the Student Research Association, an organization revolving around faculty student research. Tarleton's personal attention for each student and how much each faculty member genuinely cares is why all students succeed. I connected with professors across campus who not only helped me succeed academically, but helped my peers achieve what they thought was impossible. Tarleton has given me so many opportunities and my professors have strengthened me through their advice and encouragement. I know that no matter where I am, the gates here at Tarleton will always be open and I will forever bleed purple. That's all from me. Take it away, Alex. Wow, it's so great to learn about your student research and see that faculty are willing to take you under their wing. It's evident that your work is gonna change the world. Let's meet Donovan. Donovan is a senior kinesiology major from Sweeney, Texas, and a member of the Tarleton Texan football team. He's ready to tell us all about Texan Nation and game day on campus. Donovan, you are up. Thank you, Alex. What's up, everyone? Playing football at Tarleton State University on the Division I team has been a big accomplishment for me. Ever since I stepped foot on this campus, I felt like I was at home. 
The coaches, professors, and staff really care about the students and they want you to succeed, which is something I really love about Tarleton. I really enjoy taking part in the university spirit and tradition. As a football player, my favorite, of course, is game day. I love the rally on Rudder where the football team, band, and cheer and dance teams march to the Major General Earl Rudder statue. Here, the Texan Corps of Cadets motivates the team with a speech inspired by the heroism of General Rudder and fires the cannon as we continue on to Memorial Stadium. It's not just the football games. All of our athletics are great. We offer 16 NCAA sports, and every single team on our campus loves representing the purple and white all across the country. The tradition here is strong, and it matters. Our athletic facilities are top-notch, from the expanded Memorial Stadium to the new track and field complex, updated baseball and softball complex, our soon-to-come 7,500-seat sporting and events arena to our new athletics administration and academic success building. Tarleton values our success in competition and in the classroom. Regardless of major, attending Tarleton State University, you will receive an excellent education and opportunities that will prepare you for your journey after college. Becoming a Texan, I had no career plan. Following my first year, I knew my calling was to become a coach. Excellent guidance boosted my confidence in chasing my dreams. That's all from me. That's awesome, Donovan. And it's awesome to see the hype of Texan Nation on game day. Best of luck on your journey to become a coach. You clearly have some great role models here to look up to. Okay, we're diving into Tarleton's world-class rodeo program with Jacob. Jacob is a graduate student competing with the team in team roping, and he'll show us why there's no better place to rodeo than here in Stephenville, Texas, the cowboy capital of the world. Jacob, take it away. Thanks, Alex. Hey, y'all. I am a team member and graduate assistant for the Tarleton Rodeo team. Being able to compete and work directly with the coaches here at Tarleton Rodeo has been one of the greatest experiences of my college career. And these past few years have flown by. I'm excited to share my experiences with you and a little bit more about our program. Tarleton Rodeo competes in the Southwest region of the National Intercollegiate Rodeo Association. Tarleton Rodeo is one of the most decorated collegiate rodeo programs in the nation with 37 national championships. Eight of those national championships are team titles, four each for both the men and women's team. Most recently, Tarleton clinched the 2022 College National Finals Rodeo Championship with the men's team and clinched an individual title in the steer wrestling. This season, over 150 student athletes will wear the purple vest, which is an unmistakable symbol of the history of the legacy of our winning program. Our Bob and Darla Doty Rodeo Complex is the premier collegiate rodeo training facility in the nation. It's close to our main campus, and it features a covered indoor arena with bleachers, an outdoor practice arena, over 30 horse stalls. We also have a hot walker to exercise our horses, a saltwater spa, and even a gym. Tarleton really makes sure that they take care of us as student athletes and take care of our horses. Coming to Tarleton was one of the greatest decisions I ever made. I'm so blessed that I get to not only represent this great university, but the rodeo team as well. Thank you for listening. What's next, Alex? Thanks, Jacob. It makes sense that the greatest collegiate rodeo program in the nation would also have the greatest rodeo practice facility. That was incredible. Take care. Okay, it's time to meet Drew, a sophomore studying civil engineering. We're gonna hear from Drew about the different learning spaces across campus and how the state-of-the-art engineering facilities at Tarleton made his decision to join the Mayfield College of Engineering, an easy, easy choice. Drew, please take it away. Thanks for the intro, Alex. Hey there, everyone. I grew up close to Steamville, Texas, home of Tarleton's main campus. I knew I always wanted to design roads, bridges, buildings, and other infrastructures. In this, I would seek a civil engineering degree. Seeing the amazing new programs and facilities that Tarleton has to offer, the decision was easy. Some of Tarleton's greatest highlights are its laboratories and facilities. We're standing in the Mayfield College of Engineering, where its high-tech labs and classrooms are inspiring. 
I'm looking forward to my upper level courses and working in the labs with the water flume, conducting titration experiments, and using the surveying equipment. Additional state-of-the-art learning spaces at Tarleton include the School of Nursing Simulation Hospital and the College of Science and Mass Planetarium and Observatory, and our College of Agriculture and Natural Resource Science, where my twin brother is a student. Features our Agriculture Centers, Animal and Plant Science Center, the Equine Center, and the Southwest Regional Dairy Center, the only full working dairy as a part of a university in Texas. Talton provides great tools and research opportunities and hands-on experience that lead to innovative real-world solutions. I'm excited to continue my college journey, and I hope you join us. Come to Tarleton and change the world of tomorrow today. Back to you, Alex. Amazing stuff, Drew. Tarleton's commitment to state-of-the-art facilities is easily seen. No matter your major, Tarleton students have all sorts of cool places to learn their craft. And how cool is it that both you and your twin brother get to experience Tarleton together? Okay, we're gonna meet Marco, a senior nursing major from Houston, Texas. He's gonna tell us about his experience getting involved at Tarleton, how he found his purpose and place on campus, and the ways students can get involved to make a huge impact. Thanks, Alex. Hey, y'all. When coming to Tarleton, I thought I'd be an ag teacher, but found my true passion in nursing. I wanted to get involved and quickly found a place where I could be my authentic self. I joined the Tarleton Transition Mentors Program, where I was able to help incoming freshmen transition into college life and be comfortable with being themselves. I later got involved in the Student Government Association as the Vice President of Programming, where I helped plan some of our homecoming events. Being involved pushed me to help others while making meaningful connections. One of my most meaningful involvements was joining the Lambda Chi Alpha fraternity. I became more comfortable with myself and the bond of new brothers. We continue to grow with each other and make a positive impact in our community. At Tarleton, there are many opportunities to get involved. We offer over 150 organizations, ranging from academic groups and spirit organizations to social clubs, Greek life, and more. Students can find their true place and surround themselves with like-minded people. Tarleton is also incredibly service-based. One event in particular is Tarleton Roundup. It is the largest student-led community service project where we serve close to 150 local residents, helping them pull weeds, pick up trash, and rake leaves. It's a great opportunity for us to give back to the community that gives so much to us. From my courses to amazing organizations, I have learned to be a better leader and a better person. This has helped prepare me for my career and to help those around me. I wouldn't be where I am or even who I am if it wasn't for everything that Tarleton's given me. Remember, get involved, make your mark, and leave your legacy. Now back to you, Alex. That was great, Marco. It's so inspiring to see how getting involved made such an impact on your college journey. There's surely a way for each student to find their place on campus by getting involved. That was awesome, take care. Allow me to introduce Naomi, an early childhood education major from Tarleton's Fort Worth campus. She'll talk about her... <laughs> Welcome everyone to Tarleton State University. Tarleton is one of the fastest growing public universities in the nation, located in Stephenville, Texas. With over 15,000 students and more than 120 unique degree programs. Originally founded in 1899 as a college of agriculture, Tarleton has evolved into a comprehensive university that touches every aspect of society. Students study industry leading healthcare practices, teacher education, engineering, business, criminal justice, and yes, even 100 years later, Tarleton is still leading the way with one of the largest agriculture colleges in the nation. Tarleton stays true to its mission to provide opportunity, 
access and affordability for all students. I'm your host, Alex Boylan, and over the next half hour, you'll hear from students about Tarleton's deep-rooted tradition, world-class rodeo team, Division I athletics, hands-on learning, and Tarleton's commitment to student success. And just wait until you meet the Purple Po. Welcome to Tarleton State University. This is the College Tour. We're heading over to meet up with Magnolia, a graduate student majoring in communication studies. Magnolia is a spirited Tarleton Texan, and you'll soon see why she is the perfect person to tell us about Tarleton's deep-rooted traditions, spirit, and of course, the purple poo. Take it away, Magnolia. Thanks, Alex. Here at Tarleton State University, the gates are always open, and I want to give you a full Tarleton welcome. I am so honored to share my Tarleton story and show you how our deep-rooted traditions and spirit make Tarleton such a special place. I immediately knew that Tarleton was home and a place to connect for a lifetime. During my time here, I served for two years as a member of the Purple Poo. The Purple Poo is a secret organization, the oldest spear organization in the state, established in 1921. They dress from head to toe in colorful clothing and disguise their voices to conceal their identities. Graduating seniors unmask in the spring semesters at the Purple Poo Reveal. The Purple Poo embodies a physical rendition of the spirit of Tarleton. So when you see them, those are my brothers and sisters. When it comes to tradition, homecoming week is jam packed with them. From lighting of the smokestack, launching the ducks and yell contest to welcoming home our proud alumni at one of the state's largest bonfires. And we can't forget about the parade and football game. Homecoming week is your ticket to Tarleton tradition. We're pretty big on spirit. We wear purple on Thursdays, and we do not walk on the grass, ever. And we love to show our pride by holding our states up hand gesture. Traditions at Tarleton are unique and unmatched. They unite us and foster a sense of belonging. And I will carry those experiences in my heart for life. Make it no secret that whatever your goals are, you will reach unfathomable ones here at Tarleton State University. I am so honored to share this special place that I call home with all of you. Hey, Oscar P. Back to you, Alex. Wow, the energy, spirit, and rich traditions are one of a kind. I can clearly see why Tarleton bleeds purple. I'm definitely gonna need to come back for homecoming. Thanks, Magnolia. Let's say hi to Lily. Lily is a sophomore in education major who lived in Honeywell Hall as a first year student. Here's Lily, who's gonna walk us through life on campus and all the options students have just steps from their home away from home. Hey everybody, and thank you for the introduction, Alex. One of the biggest aspects of college is living on campus. What your dorm will look like, who your roommate will be, all of the activities that take place in between. Tarleton State University provides a welcoming living and learning environment and gives you a home feeling that not a lot of universities have. Living on campus, everyone on my floor became my family. We went to every event together, cheered at every home game, and started our own traditions within our friend group. We even had cookouts in the kitchen of our building with our resident leaders. Everything on campus is within walking distance and very easily accessible. The dining hall and the student center are right in the center of campus and both provide a wide variety of eating options, including national chain restaurants. And both make for great study and hangout spots. You're also in close proximity to mental health and physical wellness resources with our campus recreation, aquatic center, and our student health and counseling center. You'll probably see me and my friends at the rec playing volleyball together. I can say without a doubt that living here at Tarleton has been one of the best experiences of my life. I've made lifelong friends and countless memories. Tarleton has given me a second family. I know I can count on my friends and residential leaders to be there for anything I may need, even if it's just somebody to walk to class with. That's all from me. Alex, wanna join us on campus?
Absolutely. It's clear to see why anyone would want to live here. And you've made so many great friends along the way. Maybe I'll run into you at the rack. Thanks again, Lily. Let's chat with Madison. Madison is a senior kinesiology major. She'll tell us about her experience working directly with patients and how her time at Tarleton has prepared her for the next step after college. Madison, it's all yours. Thanks for the introduction, Alex, and hello, everyone. Being a fourth generation Tarleton Texan, I knew I wanted to get as much out of my time at Tarleton as possible. Tarleton has helped prepare me for my future career as a healthcare professional through hands-on learning experiences. Tarleton really stands out with its emphasis on hands-on learning. Across all majors, students get real-world experiences as a part of their degree program. As a kinesiology major, our hands-on models and anatomage tables enable us to study in depth. Our classes incorporate a lecture and lab model where we learn the material and the procedure and then have the chance to safely put it into practice using equipment in class. The Kinesiology Lab is another great resource as it provides the opportunity to gain experience with real people who come into the clinic. An observational internship is also incorporated into our degree plan to give us clinical experience in our career setting, which is a huge asset when it comes to applying for secondary programs and jobs. More examples include our year-long teacher residency programs, the Tarleton Agricultural Center's Working Farm, the Phage Lab where students get to research viruses, and our broadcast journalism studio where students get true to career experience in news production. These experiences prepare Tarleton students for success beyond graduation and into their career. Our professors also do their very best to ensure that we succeed. Through all of these experiences, I've learned what professionalism looks like and what it takes to become a good student and clinician. After graduation, I plan to attend chiropractic school and specialize in working with children or athletes. I can't wait to give back to my future community all of the skills, compassion, and resources that I've been given at my time at Tarleton. Well, that's my story. Back to you, Alex. Madison, thanks for telling us all about the different opportunities to get hands-on experience both in kinesiology and across campus. It's clear Tarleton students are ready to succeed in any career field. We're gonna hear from James, a biomedical science student from Flower Mound, Texas. From the moment James became a Tarleton student, he was connected with mentors who have helped guide his journey to ensure success. James, it's all you. Thanks, Alex. What's up, everyone? Growing up, I always knew that I wanted to pursue a career in the medical field, and that all starts with the proper education. While searching for the best college, I came across Tarleton and immediately knew that this was the right place for me. I was greeted with all kinds of student support. At Duck Camp, I had two Tarleton transition mentors who helped me build confidence and taught me all the traditions. When I started my first semester, I was assigned two more peer mentors who had the same major I had. My incredible mentors offered in-depth solutions to all my questions, and I really owe it to them for my accomplishments. Here at Tarleton, we have knowledgeable and understanding professors who strive for students not only to finish with a high grade, but also to completely understand the subject. Working with Tarleton professors has been a pleasure, and I know that they're positioning me for success. In addition, we have many great resources to ensure each student's success. Academically, we offer the Tutoring and Learning Center, Math and Science Clinics, Supplemental Instruction, and much more. When it comes to paying for school, 85% of Tarleton students receive some sort of financial aid, and we have over 500 scholarship opportunities. Over half of our student body is first generation, and our Office of Diversity, Inclusion, and International Programs offers resources that encourages an equitable, accessible, diverse, and inclusive campus culture. Tarleton is committed to making sure all students receive everything they need for the best college experience. I serve as a Tarleton Transition Mentor and Peer Mentor to give back the support that has helped me become successful. Tarleton's student-focused approach has made my experiences amazing, and I know that I'm prepared for my future and can handle any obstacle that comes my way. Thank you so much for listening to my story. Over to you, Alex. Thank you for sharing your story, James, your evidence that every Tarleton Texan can reach their full potential. But the real question is, how do I get some of those duck camp overalls? That was awesome. Take care. 
Let's go see what Arad is up to. Arad is a mathematics major studying data science specializing in infectious diseases. He's gonna tell us about how one-on-one -on -one attention from his professors helped him find his calling and his place at Tarleton. Arad, you are on. Thank you for that introduction, Alex. Hey, what's up, y'all? Growing up, I was always told to focus on my math and science, but I didn't think that my career goals would lead me to such a place where I would meet lifelong friends and amazing faculty mentors. I had several options for college, but Tarleton really stood out over the others. Great faculty-student ratio, great personal attention. Here at Tarleton, students know they are a name, not a number. My first year, I learned I wanted to study infectious diseases, and my professors and mentors guided me to the right major and path. During my first semester, I was introduced to the vast world of research by a mathematics research professor whom I currently conduct undergraduate research with. Since then, my life has never been the same. I have conducted research with several faculty members, had the opportunity to work with the university president, and even created the Student Research Association, an organization revolving around faculty student research. Tarleton's personal attention for each student and how much each faculty member genuinely cares is why all students succeed. I connected with professors across campus who not only helped me succeed academically, but helped my peers achieve what they thought was impossible. Tarleton has given me so many opportunities and my professors have strengthened me through their advice and encouragement. I know that no matter where I am, the gates here at Tarleton will always be open and I will forever bleed purple. That's all for me. Take it away, Alex. Wow, it's so great to learn about your student research and see that faculty are willing to take you under their wing. It's evident that your work is gonna change the world. Let's meet Donovan. Donovan is a senior kinesiology major from Sweeney, Texas, and a member of the Tarleton Texan football team. He's ready to tell us all about Texan Nation and game day on campus. Donovan, you are up. Thank you, Alex. What's up, everyone? Playing football at Tarleton State University on the Division I team has been a big accomplishment for me. Ever since I stepped foot on this campus, I felt like I was at home. The coaches, professors, and staff really care about the students, and they want you to succeed, which is something I really love about Tarleton. I really enjoy taking part in the university spirit and tradition. As a football player, my favorite, of course, is game day. I love the rally on Rudder where the football team, band, and cheer and dance scenes march to the Major General Earl Rudder statue. Here the Texan Corps of Cadets motivates the team with a speech inspired by the heroism of General Rudder and fires the cannon as we continue on to Memorial Stadium. It's not just the football games, all of our athletics are great. We offer 16 NCAA sports and every single team on our campus loves representing the purple and white all across the country. The tradition here is strong and it matters. Our athletic facilities are top notch, from the expanded Memorial Stadium to the new track and field complex, updated baseball and softball complex, our soon to come 7,500 seat sporting and events arena to our new athletics administration and academic success building. Tarleton values our success in competition and in the classroom. Regardless of major, attending Tarleton State University, you will receive an excellent education and opportunities that will prepare you for your journey after college. Becoming a Texan, I had no career plan. Following my first year, I knew my calling was to become a coach. Excellent guidance boosted my confidence in chasing my dreams. That's all from me. That's awesome, Donovan. And it's awesome to see the hype of Texan Nation on game day. Best of luck on your journey to become a coach. You clearly have some great role models here to look up to. Okay, we're diving into Tarleton's world-class rodeo program with Jacob. Jacob is a graduate student competing with the team in team roping, and he'll show us why there's no better place to rodeo than here in Stephenville, Texas, the cowboy capital of the world. Jacob, take it away. Thanks, Alex. Hey, y'all. I am a team member and graduate assistant for the Tarleton Rodeo team. Being able to compete and work directly with the coaches here at Tarleton Rodeo has been one of the greatest experiences in my college career. And these past few years have flown by. I'm excited to share my experiences with you 
and a little bit more about our program. Tarleton Rodeo competes in the southwest region of the National Intercollegiate Rodeo Association. Tarleton Rodeo is one of the most decorated collegiate rodeo programs in the nation with 37 national championships. Eight of those national championships are team titles, four each for both the men and women's team. Most recently, Tarleton clinched the 2022 College National Finals Rodeo Championship with the men's team and clinched an individual title in the steer wrestling. This season, over 150 student athletes will wear the purple vest, which is an unmistakable symbol of the history of the legacy of our winning program. Our Bob and Darla Doty Rodeo Complex is the premier collegiate rodeo training facility in the nation. It's close to our main campus, and it features a covered indoor arena with bleachers, an outdoor practice arena, over 30 horse stalls. We also have a hot walker to exercise our horses, a saltwater spa, and even a gym. Tarleton really makes sure that they take care of us as student athletes and take care of our horses. Coming to Tarleton was one of the greatest decisions I ever made. I'm so blessed that I get to not only represent this great university, but the rodeo team as well. Thank you for listening. What's next, Alex? Thanks, Jacob. It makes sense that the greatest collegiate rodeo program in the nation would also have the greatest rodeo practice facility. That was incredible. Take care.
Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Tarleton's 228th commencement. We are delighted you are here to honor the academic accomplishments of today's graduates from the colleges of business and liberal and fine arts. Damas y caballeros, bienvenidos a la ducentésimo vigésimo octava ceremonia de graduación de Tarleton. Nos complace su presencia para honrar los logros académicos de los graduandos de hoy de las facultades de negocios y artes liberales y Bellas Artes. I am Janice Horak, Executive Director of Development. Soy la doctora Ibelis Urban, profesora de español y su directora del Departamento de Inglés y Lenguas. The procession is about to begin, so now would be a good time to silence your audible devices. La procesión está a punto de comenzar, por lo que es momento de silenciar sus dispositivos audibles. President James L. Hurley will lead university officials onto the platform while our student marshals escort the class of 2023. And the faculty marshals escort our distinguished faculty into the stadium. El, pro, el presidente James L. Hurley dirigirá a los oficiales de la universidad a la plataforma, mientras los estudiantes guías escoltan a la clase del 2023 y los profesores guía a nuestros distinguidos profesores al estadio. Los profesores guías son... The marshals are Dr. Carl Ajo, Dr. Keldon Bauer, Mr. Joe Dumar, Dr. Matthew Hallgarth, Dr. Rebecca Morrow, Dr. Joseph Schusler, Dr. Joanna Shaw, Dr. Yolanda Sang, Dr. Cessna Winslow, and Dr. Yi Chia Wu. At the conclusion of the ceremony, the platform group and graduates will be led out of the stadium. Please remain in your seats until all graduates have left. Al concluir la ceremonia, el grupo de la plataforma y los graduandos saldrán del estadio. Favor de permanecer en sus asientos hasta que todos los graduandos hayan salido. At that time, you will be dismissed to join your graduate along Rudder Way, which is located east of Memorial Stadium. En ese momento, podrán abandonar el estadio para encontrarse con sus graduandos a lo largo de Rudder Way, que se encuentra al este del Estadio Memorial. And now, the group of people you have come here to honor, the Tarleton State University Class of 2023. Y ahora, el grupo de personas que han venido a honrar la clase del 2023 de la Universidad Estatal de Tarleton. The procession will be accompanied by the Tarleton Wind Ensemble under the direction of Dr. David Robinson. El conjunto de viento de Tarleton bajo la dirección del Dr. David Robinson acompañará la procesión. A los que les sea posible, favor de ponerse de pie para recibir a la procesión. Please, all who are able, rise to greet the procession.
morning Texans now come on we are not going to allow the threat of a little rain to dampen the spirit in this special day in the life of our university and for these outstanding graduates let's try this again good morning Texans I'm Dr. James Hurley and I have the distinct pleasure of serving as the president of this outstanding university welcome to the 228th commencement of Tarleton State University. This is a magnificent day for our institution as these graduates join the ranks of distinguished Tarleton alumni. To officially open this ceremony, the national anthem will be sung by your fellow classmate, Miss Robin Flatt, a graduating music performance major. Following the national anthem, the invocation will be given by Mr. Billy Snipes, student body, student body president. Gentlemen, please remove your caps. And I ask all who are able, please remain standing for the singing of the national anthem and the invocation. Let us pray. On this commencement day, while we have all traveled different paths to reach this milestone, today we are one of one mind and one heart in giving thanks for these students and for all they have accomplished. As we reflect on all, this, all that is past and all that is yet to come, we are mindful for all, 
for of the many people to whom we owe thanks. Families that encourage education, teachers and mentors who share their knowledge and experience, friends who provide support and help to make a life, lifetime of memories. May the gratitude we feel today inspire each of us to bring even greater joy into our lives and the lives of others. Amen. Please be seated. Good morning. I am Dr. Diana Ortega Ferrick, Vice President of Student Engagement and Success. At this time, I would like to recognize the members of the platform group. Please stand when introduced and hold your applause until all members are recognized. Dr. James Hurley, President. Dr. Diane Stearns, Provost and Executive Vice President for Academic Affairs. Mr. Sam Pack, Ceremony Honoree. Dr. Barry Lambert, Interim Dean of College of Graduate Studies. Dr. Raj Arosgar, Dean of College of Business. Dr. Eric Morrow, Dean, College of Liberal and Fine Arts. Mr. Billy Snipes, Student Body President. Ms. Alyssa Yule, Commencement Speaker. Ms. Robin Flatt, Commencement Singer. Please join me in recognizing all these outstanding leaders. Finally, I would like to introduce Dr. David Robinson, Director of Bands, and the members of the Charlton Wynn Ensemble, and thank them for their contributions for today's ceremonies. Graduates, I want to start by expressing how proud I am, and collectively we all are, of each of you. Reflection is an important component of growth, and in the coming weeks, months, and years, you will start reflecting back upon your Tarleton experience. I hope and trust that you will remember all of the wonderful memories that made your time here at Tarleton so special, like your first campus visit, duck camp, tea week, and lighting your flame at convocation. Perhaps you will remember that incredible faculty member that pushed you to your academic limits only because they saw the true potential inside you. That same faculty member is now your mentor and lifelong friend. I want you to always remember that Thursdays are best when dressed in purple and that the friends you have made here at Tarleton will be your best friends throughout life. Tarleton class of 2023, I am confident that you are prepared to turn challenges into opportunities, maybes into realities and possibilities into certainties. I'm also confident that our world needs more Tarleton Texans now more than ever. Whatever might lie ahead for each of you, simply trust and know that you are well prepared. You are forever a Tarleton Texan and now join the long line of distinguished alumni that will stand with you through it all. However, no one gets to this day alone. Many of the people who helped make this day possible for you are here celebrating your great accomplishment. Class of 2023, I think it's time to show your appreciation for certain members of the audience. I want to start with our outstanding and dedicated faculty and staff. Would all members of the faculty and staff please stand? Graduates, please join me in showing our uh, appreciation. Now let's recognize some very special people that have been by your side along your Tarleton journey. If you are a brother or sister of one of these graduates, would you please stand? Graduates, please join me in showing our appreciation. If you are a spouse or partner, would you please stand? If you are a child or grandchild, meaning your mommy, daddy, or grandparent is on this field graduating today, would you please stand or be held high in the air? There we go. Okay. 
If you are a parent, that means all of our moms and dads, would you please proudly stand? Moms and dads, thank you so much. And to all of our, of our wonderful moms out there, we wish you a very happy Mother's Day this Sunday. And last but certainly not least, graduates, I want you to watch the love and the smiles on their faces. Would all of our grandparents, that means grandma, grandpa, would you please stand and allow us to say thank you. As was explained before the processional, some graduates are wearing colorful cords that represent high achievement and academic honors. Some graduates are wearing red, white, and blue cords representing achievement and honor of a different sort. They are our veterans who we recognize today for their selfless service to this great nation. It is their sacrifice and that of their families that allows us to freely pursue life, liberty, love, and yes, a Tarleton education. I would like to ask that all veterans and active or reserve duty personnel in this graduating class to please rise. Audience, please join me in showing our sincere appreciation. Thank you. <clears throat> Graduates, this is your day. It is you we are here to celebrate. For this reason, a member of the graduating class has been invited to address the commencement audience. Alyssa Yule is a 2023 graduate of Tarleton's Master in Business Administration program. Alyssa is originally from Delta, Utah, but now lives in Glen Rose, Texas. Alyssa taught high school agricultural before joining her family business along her husband, Russell, and her brother-in-law, Clay. Please help me welcome Alyssa Yule. Good morning and welcome College of Business and College of Liberal and Fine Arts graduates. A special welcome to Provost Stearns, President Hurley, and this distinguished stage party. It is my honor to be here representing the College of Business. As a less traditional student than many of you, I initially felt that I shouldn't be the one to speak. Well, my life since finishing my bachelor's degree has been one full of mostly successes and accomplishments, the four years of my undergraduate degree were rocky, painful, and characterized by doubt and shame about my place in the world. It's that experience that I wanted to share with you. A few days before leaving my tiny hometown in the West Desert of Utah, my high school agriculture teacher called to offer advice. He was, and still is, one of my main sources of wisdom and stability. What he told me that day would change my approach to life for years afterwards. Without judgment, he said, next week you have the chance to start over entirely and be exactly the person you want to be. No one will know anything about you that you don't want them to know. He didn't verbalize the things that I would exclude when I created this new version of myself. He didn't need to. They were the things that I had felt shame and embarrassment about as far back as my memory stretched. I knew he meant that my father's violent temper would no longer be a baseline fact that an entire town accepted. I knew he meant that the classmates who had seen me turned away in the lunchroom with a grumbling stomach and an unpaid cafeteria bill would no longer be the ones who sat next to me afterwards in fifth period. I knew that he wanted me to step out from under the crushing weight of my family's publicly known dysfunction in a town with very few secrets. This strategy worked well for me for more than 10 years. Now in my professional life, the trauma of my childhood is my closest kept secret. I'm expected to show up each day as the face of our family's company. I need to exude confidence. I need to provide steady leadership. Even on the days when I still feel like the child watching her mother being beaten and belittled. Even on the days when I feel like the college freshman shoplifting groceries to get by. The security I feel now as I complete my MBA has given me the perspective I needed to see that I can be both this best version of myself 
and that version who was so deeply striving for more. My past fuels me to push boundaries and seek success. Yours can too. Today, you have accomplished something huge, something you have worked towards for years. Tomorrow, many of us will start new jobs in new towns with new faces. Just as my agriculture teacher told me all those years ago, you have the opportunity to show up each day after this as the best version of yourself. But it's my hope that you will also choose to remember the version that brought you to this finish line. Both are exceptional and both deserve to be celebrated today and every day. Thank you and congratulations, class of 2023. Thank you, Alyssa, and thank you for sharing your incredible story. You have certainly inspired us all and represented your class very well. Provost Stearns, would you please come forward for a very special presentation? This commencement is enriched by the presentation of an honorary degree. Such an honor is awarded only to individuals whose accomplishments and service exemplify our mission and stand as examples of our aspirations for these graduates. An honorary degree recognizes excellence as recipients have distinguished themselves in their fields of endeavor and in life. Candidates for an honorary degree must be recommended by the president and approved by the Board of Regents of the Texas A&M University System. Mr. President, it is my honor to present Mr. Sam Pack for the honorary degree Doctorate of Humane Letters. Mr. Sam H. Pack was born and raised in Stephenville, Texas. He and his wife, Carol, now reside in Dallas, Texas. In 1956, Mr. Pack attended Tarleton State College before an illness forced him to abandon his dream of earning a college degree. After Mr. Pack recovered from his illness, he entered the workforce never achieving his dream of a college degree. Today, he owns and operates Pack Automotive Group, which consists of six five-star dealerships in the Dallas-Fort Worth Metroplex, among other business ventures and investments. Sam's extraordinary business and community leadership has earned him countless business and community awards. Mr. Sam Pack has a true philanthropic heart and supports numerous community projects, organizations, and fundraising efforts. As a strong supporter of education, Mr. Pack has assisted in the creation of numerous programs at several colleges and universities, including the Tarleton State University Pack Automotive Group Intern Program. President Hurley will present the medallion and diploma to today's honoree. Dr. Ortega Farrick, will you please bring the recipient forward? By the authority vested in me as president of Tarleton State University, and in recognition of his extraordinary achievements, I proudly confer upon Dr. Sam Pack the honorary degree Doctor of Humane Letters. Sam. Thank you for your countless contributions to society and your quest to make the world a better place. Class of 2023 and all gathered here today, I proudly present to you Dr. Sam Pack. Congratulations and well deserved.
And now we are at the most important part of the ceremony, the presentation of your degrees. Will all of the candidates for degrees please rise? President Hurley, these students are candidates for the baccalaureate and master's degrees in the College of Business and the College of Liberal and Fine Arts as prescribed by the faculty of Tarleton State University and the Board of Regents of the Texas A&M University System. As Chief Academic Officer, I present them to you with both personal pleasure and Tarleton pride. Thank you, Provost Stone, Stearns. Graduates, by the authority vested in me as president of Tarleton State University, I proudly confer the bachelor's and master's degrees upon those of you who have met all requirements associated with these degrees. You now hold all honors, rights, and privileges belonging thereto. I charge you as educated men and women of the world to use your education in the service of others. Graduates, you may be seated. Student marshals, please bring the graduates forward to receive their diplomas. The following students are candidates for the master's degree in the College of Business. Shelby Diane Wright. Christine May Sproles. Jessica Janelle Day Goodwin. Godwin. Rachel Elise Bounds. Benjamin Paul Graham. Zadie May McCoy. Samantha Joella Hennig, Allison Paige Robbins, Lily Valine Reynolds, Bethany Isaacs, Alyssa Gail Ewell, Michael Hunter Damasi, Bailey Leanne Pierce, Alexis Najee Polk, Carrie Lynn Ryan, Bryce Cody Humphreys, Brandon Michael Garcia, Lane Richard Guest, Kelsey J. Thompson, Cart Courtney Bowen, Andrea Ramos Collins, Tamala Cheyenne Brogdon, Heather Nicole Hirschfield, Amber Lewis. Stevens, Ashlina Joy Cook, Patrick Lewis Hamilton, Do Donovan Noah Williams, Michael Ivan Stone, Angelina Yannette Abessia. Latoya Renee Williams Hall. Kelsey Malin Fredrickson. Daneric DeMonte Scott. Paige 
Peyton M. Bashirs. Candace Renee Thompson. Brianna Carol Dulock. Kristen Danae Phaedro. Darcy Lynn Gibson. Janae N. Brown. Michelle Vijaygran Rodriguez. Gerald Dion Glenn. Dylan Thomas English. James Terrell Adkins. Elizabeth Ramirez. Latasha Ari Curtis. Antoinette Ryan Among. Laurel Edith Schroeder. Ian William Taylor Schlitz. Casey Lamont Davis Sr. Brandy Nicole Kurth. Christian Kara Hope. Alexander Knox. Orion. Megan Orion Kite. Hannah Bell Courtney. Amy Catherine Hayford. Corey Don Morton. Cipriana Molina. Myra Osorio. Dustin Allen Barnett. Sydney Allison Gaynor. Hannah Christine Shank. Courtney Diane Dudensing. Jacob Hudson. Emmanuel Kusanaje. Christian Martin Scully. Brian Keith Plessel Ehlers. Shelly Marie Cairns Smith. Amy Harrison Hayes. Star Abia Ua Omoza. Bailey Brooke Goodall. The following students are candidates for the master's degree in the College of Liberal and Fine Arts. Sean William Baldwin. Zachary Aaron Christian. Laura Mae Goodman. Haley Beaver. Brandon Michael McDonald. Derek David Majak. David Jean Ham. Alejandro Orlando Uliberry. Lucy Laurie Wolf. Riley Page Odom. <laughs> Symphony Lowe. Chelsea Nicole Keithley. Donna Elizabeth Kennedy. Kenneth Mark Sarmiento. Jesse Gill, James McPherson, Barry Gresham the third, James Adam Coran, Kaylee 
Morgan McCarty. Benita Jewel Raspberry. Moman. Moman. The following students are candidates for the bachelor's degree in the College of Liberal and Fine Arts. Alec Michael Williams. Devin A.J. Patel, magna cum laude. Honors degree program graduate, Peyton Riley Hudson. Isaiah Augustin Campa. Dylan Kurahashi Choi Fu. Mason Allen Cruz. Reginald Lee Bailey. Kimberly Megan Burnett. Rebecca K. Pulfer. Honors degree program graduate, Skylar Janae Randall. Honors degree program graduate, Jillian Tyler. Tyler William Thompson, cum laude. Kelly Amber Beeler. Eric White. Jacob Leo Nestor. Sarah Leanne Adams. <coughs> Hayden Scott Donahue. Charlotte Yost, cum laude. Sydney Allison Billings. Honors degree program graduate, Brianna Nicole Blanks, cum laude. Evelyn Cardenas. Presidential Honors Program graduate, Brett Stephen Davini, cum laude. Allergies. Water. Selby Brianna Draker. Micaiah Ann Myers. <coughs> Dulce Daniela Ochoa Sanchez. Macy Rose Hall. Richard Reagan Russell. Haley Ray Cloninger. Elizabeth Darlene Robertson. Austin Davis. Donald Jean Cosgrove III. Ricky D. Tywater. Gareth Harp. Jacqueline Alexis Redvine. <clears throat> Brianna Lee Wilkinson. <laughs> Honors degree program graduate, Jimena Espinosa. Madison Mackenzie Fallon. Kaylee Gracie Renee Fenton. Caitlin Rowena Smith. Honors degree program graduate, Hannah Noel Mitich. Laura Madeline Riggs, magna cum laude. It's Lara. Kelsey Ray Kaiser. Emma Elizabeth Ludwig. Taylor Alexis Linehan, cum laude. Tyler Michael Duggan. Summer Davenport. Eric Lawrence Yantis. 
Maria Elena Contreras, magna cum laude. Kyle Steven Sabal. Salida Ann Sprunger, cum laude. Lindsay Michelle Moody. Mitchell Lynn Kemp. Robert Earl King Jr. Walter Smith. Ethan Dale Isbell. Clayton Garrett Wilkerson. Honors degree program graduate Aaron Mejorado, cum laude. Caitlin Page Huckton. Honors degree program graduate Jade Ann Williams. Honors degree program graduate Kaylin Marie Johnston, cum laude. Honors degree program graduate Cristo Jesus Castillo, magna cum laude. Melina Porter. <laughs> Honors degree program graduate, Amberly Victoria Adams, cum laude. Gabrielle Nicole Bell. Shakari Lafay Bati Washington. Chad Edward Cooley. Bryn Christine Potter. Aspen Faith Owen. Peyton Reese Fanning. Honors degree program graduate Hannah Bray Fortune. Kayla Denise Hickman. Sarah Nicole Belknap. Morgan Alexandria Pugh. Ashton Bostic, summa cum laude. Maggie Goebel. Jennifer Castro. Lauren Taylor Walls. Guadalupe Del Rocio Arzibar. Julia Melton. Clayton Eric Morris. Tanner Riley Pritchard. Braley Rhiannon Redwine. Brinkley Byard Florence. Trinity Faith San Juan. Kiera Ruth Owen. Samantha Brittany Cortez. Miranda Jane Baker. Cameron Taylor Dyer. Elizabeth Lee Black. Ashley Lauren Thiel, magna cum laude. DeAndre Anthony Campbell. Alfredo Rocha. Honors degree program graduate, Diana Natalia Perez, cum laude. Randy Glenn Geyer. Misty Dawn Kimmel. Paige Elizabeth Murphy. Bailey Morgan Bernal. Sydney Nicole Smith. 
Honors degree program graduate, Dimitri Devance Frazier. Sopip Lim Frias. Isaac Porter McQuiston, cum laude. Jackson Lewis Lush. Landon Wyatt Ruth. J.C. K. Halliday. Honors degree program graduate, Sadie Ray Cohen. Regina Ray Walters. Ashlyn Briley Cash, cum laude. Chloe Lachey Smith. Ashlyn Grace Leip. Rose Marie Vasquez. Honors degree program graduate, Emily Ann McDevitt, magna cum laude. Cade Jacob Weaver. Jayla Shanice Tyner. Keely Shay Thomas. Mia Carr. Michelle Sanam Fossner. Ali Danielle Thurman, magna cum laude. David Polazios. Samantha Nicole Etheridge. Christacia Kiara Drake. Honors degree program graduate, Leslie June Moore, cum laude. Charles Houston. Blake Nicole Smith. Daryl Jean Davis II, cum laude. Tyler James Beeson. Juan Pablo Garcia. Isabel Camille Gotera, magna cum laude. Madeline Ann McKenzie, summa cum laude. Jonathan Brooks per year. Rebecca Ray Haynes, summa cum laude. Nolan Ray Lewis Underwood. Daniela Cisneros. Honors degree program graduate, Robert Lloyd Parnell. Kayla Faith Smith. Jabrina Renee Preston. Jaquela Lachelle Shireen Daniels. Christian Ashley DeGrasse. Carson James Verigi. Zachary Bunk Carruthers. Jamie Lynn Royal. Honors degree program graduate, Marisol Rios. Jaylee Grace Nall, cum laude. Presidential Honors Program graduate, Caitlin Grace Hoffman, summa cum laude. Robin Flat, cum laude. Honors degree program graduate, Cassandra Diane White, cum laude. Keondrick Tavon Riley. 
Honors degree program graduate Maxwell Logan Tyndall Cum Laude. Kale T. Wallace. Stephen Allen McFannin. Ivan Anthony Gonzalez. Charles Jefferson Strong. Michael Keith Vernon. Nathan Ray Morgan. Guillermo Christopher Santoya. His name's William. Carla Erica Ruiz. Spencer Gage Leftwich. Cade Gerhardt Ro Henry Rokney. Landon Davis. Heidi Ann Tiffin. Ashley Nicole Rodriguez. Jenna Rose Petrohoy, magna cum laude. Jasmine Rojas. Laney Nicole Walden Heine. Angel Gurai Jr. Abby Brooke Gentry. Reagan Michelle Marriott. Brandon Alexander Marriott. Delaney Aaron Williams. Ruby Steel Park Cobb. William Bradley Duckett. Heather Jean Stewart, summa cum laude. Hannah Sierra Catherine Brown. Gloria Nicole Morrow. Lamonte Washington. Esmeralda Chides. Trinity Jade Smith. Pedro Lopez. Christopher Lloyd Womack. The following students are candidates for their bachelor's degree in the College of Business. Jillian Marie McNeil, cum laude. Rachel Ann Huddleston. Ryan Lee Wood. Alun Short. Cassidy Taylor Roden. Christina Michelle Hughes. Grierson Worley. Melissa M. Cox. Sydney Renee Butler. Diana Marie Waples. <clears throat> Sharde Kulenani Kelly, cum laude. Alden Wartez Kelly, cum laude. Yadira Moreno. Favor Oluwani Fesimi Akinsola, magna cum laude. Tanner Jackson Hans. Christian Contreras. Presley Jeanette Burkhart. McKenna Page Failer, cum laude. Emily Cecil. Valerie Brianne Vallejo, magna cum laude. Presidential Honors Program graduate, Haley Nicole Van Teen, cum laude. Caitlin Faith Herman. 
Chance Hogan Carroll. Noah Gabriel Patterson, cum laude. Joshua Levi Owens, cum laude. Jacob E. Welch. Cole Farrick. Alicia Michelle Morrison. Gabrielle Hernandez. Okay, no, you're good. Jennifer Eloise Taylor. Randy K. Rapolo. Antoinette Anna Fisher, magna cum laude. Jamin Nicholas Byers. Joey Marcella. Kulin, Peyton Lee Woosley, Honors Degree Program Graduate, Madison Alexis Jones, Magna Cum Laude, Jace Wesley Newman, Andrew James Patterson, Delane May Holly, Cum Laude, Rebecca Lynn Ramirez. David Solomon McManus. Latiera Morris. Carla Vanessa Valenzuela Rios. Britain, Brittany Ann Robinson. Michael Otuki Mokwa Ogutu. Dustin Don Scoggins. Jonathan Polanco Castillo. Claudia Gonzalez. Ashley Noel Rubel. Kylie Cheyenne Bell Davis. Acacia Johnson. Hannah Faith McGrath, magna cum laude. Annie Abelt Haley, cum laude. Michelle Faith Biondo. Vivian Michelle Kinsey. McKenna Lauren Berry. Mackenzie Lynn Zuloff Bridges. Amber Deanne Stork. Ahmad Nazib. Alma Afreen, summa cum laude. Morris Anthony Smith, Jr. Anteria Denisa Haywood Betts. Summer Caitlin McIntyre. Rebecca Nicole Bradley. Sierra A. Walker. Usman Yakubu Baca. Honors Degree Program graduate, Carlos, Carlos Perez. Pete Rodriguez Thames Jr. Honors Degree Program graduate, Hallie Holbrook. Taylor Christian Stanley. Tyler Austin Ryder. Shawnee Lenise East. Tanner Houston Sellers, cum laude. Alba Lizeth Gonzalez. Davis Ryan Vizi. Harry Liu. Noah Tyler Aleman. Arturo Sarmiento. Diana Lara Lara Martinez. Marissa Gross. Abubakar Ali. Bailey Shea Laudermilk. 
Mason Reed Newkirk. Justin Domingo Montalbo. Madison Megan Rich, magna cum laude. Brooke Catherine Russell. Steven Tyler Lane. Matthew Douglas Johnson. Anna Elizabeth Shindall, magna cum laude. Benjamin Lawrence Kehoe. Jonas Mojica. Taylor Renee Metcalf, magna cum laude. Allison Page Duckett. Kyle Charles Weber. Jeremy Lee Williams. Kelly Marie Redman Klima. Colby Allen Swecker. Corbin Arbery Stockman. Ray Robert Magellan. Victor Hugo Najera. Tyler Shane Newberry. Haley Renee Payne. Sydney Ray Benton. Madison Lee Carpenter. Jessica Nicole Harder. Stephen Jake Gallagher. Katie Nicole Arnold. Calvin Craig Shanefeld, magna cum laude. McKenna Lee Laudermilk. Presidential Honors Program graduate, Emily Faith Lehman, magna cum laude. Brandon Keith Traw. Madison Marie Brantner, cum laude. Honors Degree Program graduate, Ingram Marcella Brown, cum laude. Asher Lane Hawk, magna cum laude. Jenna Ramos. Andrew Oyerbidas. Met Mark Ribeiro. Honors Degree Program graduate, Emily Ann Couch. Dawson Matthew Reedy. Edgar Alonso Rodriguez. Myrissa Welch. Savannah Thayan Hawkins. Sainabu Chom. Thomas Moore. Richard Joseph Viscaino. Haley Solano. Danielle Marie Schrader. Lacey Lynn Gager, cum laude. William Alton Heath. William Connor Gibbs. Michael Kobe Fleming. Talisha J. Byers. Christy Michelle McAvoy, cum laude. Nicholas Dale Haviland, magna cum laude. Kayla Hubri. Leah LaVon Blankenship. Orlando Pedro Rios, cum laude. Sage Alyssa Cups. Faros Nasir Farhad. Mackenzie Hope Hunt. 
Alexander Joe Garcia, magna cum laude. Janelle Ray Moss, honors degree program graduate, Brandon Robert Lee. Garrett Van Owen Dickey. Cunning Cambry Lee, magna cum laude. Mason Tanner Truex. Barbara Crawford. Selena Hernandez. Jasmine Nicole Hernandez cum laude. Blaine Riley Gluck. Jordan Douglas Graham. Connor O'Keefe Matheson. Ashley Nicole Treese, magna cum laude. David Jose Hernandez. Honors degree program graduate, Crystal Nadine Hall. Rebecca Guadalupe Sanchez Villegas. Julia Leanne Averett. Emily Ortiz. Jessica Pearl Hines, cum laude. William Alexander Hoover. Colton Sean Kidd. Caitlin Mallory Long. Naya Raquel Herndon. Hannah Alyssa Baldry. Hannah May Heilman. Honors degree program graduate, Julia Lee Fincher. Lakendria Elizabeth Small. Aaron Mitchell Sampson. Jessica Lauren Green, cum laude. Zachary Hayden Tate. Donovan Isaiah Bakari. Dawson Paul Simbach. Lindsey Grace Gola. Ryland Lane Holloway. Cade Austin Beatty. Rosanna Garcia. Simeon Floyd Ellsworth. Barrett Allen Hammonds. Sydney Alexis Boggs. Meredith Elise Banks. London Paris Bullinier. Christopher Man Manuel Torres. Kaylin Kyle Hubbard. Jordan Nicole Simmons. Honors degree program graduate, Teresa Sofia Fernandez. Eduardo Cipres Villanueva. Cassie Chandrell Turner. Nathan Robert Edgar. Lacey Ann Helm Merrill. Matthew Kai Griggs. Laramie Tennyson Smith, summa cum laude. John Brian Hartgraves. Renee Lee Kettler. Javier, just say. Kelsey Denise Starr. Haley Brooke Winter. Leah June Taylor, magna cum laude. Catherine Grace Klusman, cum laude. Hannah Madison Bell. Karen Casada. Delaney Ray Ellis. Elias Guadarrama Perea. Courtney Amor Real. 
Claudia Sanchez. Shannon Taylor Glover. Brittany Taylor Schrader. Robert Thomas Edwards. Jessica Nobles. Jeanette Julissa Vasquez Hernandez, cum laude. Stefan J. Turner. Ryan Wesley Taylor. Christopher Blake Gregory. Daryl Oluwadamilola Wayne Harris. Honors degree program graduate, Joshua Craig Waller, cum laude. Julian Saxon Wakeland. Victoria Elizabeth Holden, cum laude. Grayson Stone. Courtney Elia Slick. Summer Rain Young. Selena Reynoso, cum laude. Meredith Haberl. Juan Miguel Gandara. All right, last but not least, baby. As our final graduates are making their way back to the stage, I can safely say at the College of Business in Colfa, class of 2023, you have been living well. Look at this weather. We will take a little wind over the rain, so well done. I'd also like to take this moment to thank Ms. Janice Horak, Dr. Momen Kazi, and Dr. Javier Garza. Let's stand up. Let's give them a big hand for reading all the names of our graduates. Well done. Great job. Would all the graduates please rise. There are two very important traditions at our commencement ceremonies. At the university's official ring ceremony, we ask that you wear your ring with a T facing in until you graduate. For those graduates who wear a Tarleton class ring, you may now turn your rings with the T facing out or away from you so that you will show the world and let them know that you are a proud Tarleton grad. So graduates, please go ahead and turn those rings at this time. And finally, the tassels on the caps of undergraduates are worn on the right side until they receive their degrees. A time-honored tradition at graduation ceremonies involves the symbolic movement of your tassel from the right to the left side. Undergraduates, you may now move your tassel. Ladies and gentlemen, it is with great pleasure that I introduce to you the newest graduates of Tarleton State University. Let's give it up a big congratulations and job well done, class of 2023.
Graduates, it has been my great honor to present you with your degrees. And now we look forward to watching your involvement as active, engaged alumni. I encourage you to come back and visit us often and never forget the gates of Tarleton are always open. On behalf of the entire Tarleton family, we wish you happiness, peace, and prosperity along your life's journey. Godspeed, class of 2023, and may you forever bleed purple. Thank you. To close today's ceremony, I ask Robin Flatt to come forward to lead the singing of a colored song, our university alma mater. I encourage the audience to sing along. Following the colored song, we ask all guests to remain at their seats while the, while the platform group and students lead the recessional. Gentlemen, please remove your caps and I ask all who are able to please rise for the singing of the colored song and the recessional.